Welcome to DeGray's 2022 Mineral Resource Update. Over the next few minutes, we'll take you through some of the highlights of our resource. But first of all, I'd like to thank our staff and crew on site for all the heavy work they've done over the last 11 months. We're pretty excited with our new resource, 10.5 million ounces. It's very strong with the indicated category, and we are looking forward to the PFS coming out in the next few months. The Malona Project Mineral Resource Statement now stands at 250 million tonnes at 1.3 grams for 10.6 million ounces. Within that, HEMI represents 213 million tonnes at 1.2 grams for 8.5 million ounces. The Malona Gold Project now represents Australia's largest undeveloped gold project and is still growing. The HEMI Mineral Resource is based on 323 diamond holes, 949 RC holes since discovery two years ago, giving a discovery cost of less than $10 an ounce for inferred resources and $17 an ounce for indicator resources. The bulk of the resources are above 370 metres from surface and make it suitable for large scale open pit mining. Further drilling is required to test at depth. Overall, the HEMI resource has increased 25% with most substantial increases coming in the indicator resources, where we have doubled them from 2.8 million ounces to 5.8 million ounces. The biggest individual gains on the resources were seen at Ducon and Eagle. Last year, the Ducon Eagle resource combined was 1.4 million ounces at 0.9 of a gram. This new upgrade takes Ducon to 1.6 million ounces at 1.3 grams. And within that, the indicated has gone to 1.3 million ounces at 1.4 grams. And Eagle is just under a million ounces at 1.1 grams. And 600,000 ounces of that at 1.2 grams is indicated. The Brolga deposit represents 2.4 million ounces at 1.2 grams. Within that, 1.6 million ounces at 1.3 grams is in the indicated category. All the deposits remain open at depth of particular note is the Ducon Eagle deposits which remain laterally open to the west. The robust nature of the HEMI resource is highlighted by the following cutoff grades. At 0.3 cutoff grade, the resource stands at 8.5 million ounces at 1.2 grams. And at 0.5 cutoff, it's at 7.9 million ounces at 1.5 grams per tonne. Importantly, the HEMI deposits show strong gold endowment and underpins the economic of large-scale open pit mining. Importantly, Brolga averages 6,700 ounces per vertical metre and in the top 200 metres of that deposit averages 10,700 as an exceptional deposit and is one of the reasons the starter pit in the scoping study commences at Brolga. Importantly, the other deposits are fairly significant in their own right, averaging just over 2,000 ounces per vertical metre, up to 4,700, and a grand total of 23,000 ounces per vertical metre. The high resource confidence is highlighted in this table, where we show the indicated resources in particular, ranging from 0.3 cut off grade, which shows 5.6 million ounces at 1.3 grams, through to 0.5 cut off grade, showing 5.3 million ounces at 1.5 grams all inside an open pit resource shell based on a $2,500 gold price. The future upside of the Malina project continues to grow around the HEMI project in itself, but also on the regional deposits, where we have 10 rigs working all together. Currently on the regional targets, we're targeting Calvert, Withnall and Malina, with new discoveries starting to emerge at Charity Well, Jeemers and drillings underway at Snakewood and Buckle. Thank you for taking the time to listen to DeGray's resource update. The resource underpins our PFS study, which is due in September quarter. We look forward to keeping you up to date as we progress going forward.